In this video, we will talk about classification of bones. Based on their structure, bones are classified into following six types long bones, short bones, flat bones, irregular bones, sesamoid bones, accessory bones, long bones. These bones mostly have an anchor function, it consists of a cylindrical shaft and two expanded smooth ends on each side of shaft. These ends are used for articulation, for example, radius and ulna of upper limb. Short bones, short bones are mostly used for connection between other bones. Most of their surface area is occupied by cartilage that helps in articulation. These bones have equal dimensions in length, width and thickness, but these bones are irregular in shape. These bones consist of spongy bone, covered by compact bone, for example, carpal bones of wrists, tarsal bones of ankles, flat bones. Flat bones are mostly used for protection against trauma. These bones consist of a layer of spongy bone, known as diplo, sandwiched between two layers of compact bone, known as tables, for example, ribs, sternum, scapulae, and bones of skull vault. Irregular bones, they have an irregular shape, with many processes. They are composed of spongy bone, covered by compact bone, for example, hip bone, vertebrae, bones of base of skull, like, sphenoid, temporal, mastoid, bones of face, maxilla, zygomatic. A special type of irregular bones is, pneumatic bones. These are a category of irregular bones, that have air-filled cavities inside them. These cavities are called, air sinuses, or air cells. These cavities make the skull lighter. These are also a favorite site for infection, thus causing sinusitis. For example, pneumatic bones are bones of maxilla, ethmoid and mastoid bones, sesamoid bones. These are bony nodules, embedded within tendons and muscles. They act as pulleys, for tendons to slide over smoothly, thus allow tendons to move efficiently. For example, patella, is the largest sesamoid bone in the body. It is embedded in quadriceps femoris muscle, as it crosses the knee joint. The last category is, accessory bones. These bones are not normally present. They are of three types, supernumerary bones, wormian bones, heterotropic bones, supernumerary bones. It forms, when an extra secondary center of ossification, appears within the main bone that gives rise to a separate bone instead of fusing with the main bone. This new bone is called, supernumerary bone. For example, os vasalianum, appears adjacent to the tuberosity of fifth metatarsal bone, wormian bones, it appears as small bony islands, between sutures of bones of skull vault. It is also known as, intrasutural bones. For example, it occurs mostly in the lambdoid suture of skull. Heterotrophic bones, these bones develop in soft tissues, like muscles. For example, rider's bones are found in, adductor muscles of horse riders.